Hey, this is YBR back with Wreckfest, and it has been a long, long time since I last played this game. So long, in fact, I don't even think there was an economy to the game back then, but now there is, and we can buy cars and parts and all that. And we start off with 5,000 credits, and I was kind of looking at what cars we could buy, and I decided I want to buy the Asian One, which costs $5,530. We have $5,000, so we got to go make a little bit of money. And then we'll be able to buy that, hopefully. So I'm going to go ahead and just start off a race on the figure eight track because that one should be the most fun track to do. And the track here is nice and simple. It just basically looks like the shape of an eight, hence the name figure eight. And I'm starting in second place. That is a huge advantage on this track because this one is really hard to make a ground because there's just so much chaos going on at all times, except for me, like just the first lap right here where everybody's bunched together. But once we get some distance between us, that's when things get dangerous. And I'm actually probably going to be the first car to crash because I'm leading off so much. It just makes it that much easier for me to get crashed into. So like right here, there's a bunch of cars. I see one. Making sure I don't hit him. Hit the wall a little bit by doing that. But hey, I didn't lose momentum. I was able to keep on my momentum and keep going. But it's going to be harder and harder to do that as there's a roll. Okay. Yep. That's okay. That is not the direction I want to go, guys. I want to go the other way. Alright, so now I have dropped down to 5th or 6th, 5th, there we go, 5th, because the guy in 6th just flipped over. Or the guy who was in 5th just flipped over, and now he's in 6th, 7th, 8th, probably way worse than that now. So we're going to try this a little bit harder. Don't spin out on me! What are you doing, car? It's like, I'm going to spin out. Uh-uh, no you ain't. Keep going. I think the person in 1st just had something slow them up a bit. Up oh, there's second and first. Okay, back in the lead. All right, just got to hold it up for a couple more laps. Will I be able to make this jump cleanly? Yes. Every time you make a clean jump, your heart just calms down a little bit. Because that right there is the only thing that can make me lose, is getting crashed into it this time. No cars coming. Beautiful. Out of the way. You're way back in the pack. I'm lapping you. Just stay out of my way. One more lap. Oh, and he tries to overtake me. I had to slow down right there. Oh, chaos. I am actually just pulling through this amazingly for how much I've crashed. I would think I'd be in like 8th or something for the amount I've crashed. I didn't want to get hit by that guy. So I think finish line's coming up, man. It is coming up right there. First place with a time of 1 minute and 56 seconds. That gets us a pretty good amount of damage. We don't get any bonuses. Oh, wait. We do get a bonus for the fastest lap. Although, I don't know how much you actually get for winning. Maybe it tells you once you hit continue. Ah, it does. So, I received $580 and 400 experience. And that 580 is including my bonus. And the car I wanted was 5370. So, we can go ahead and purchase that. And we could drive the new car. It's new to me, at least. Is what I mean. Oh, that looks so much cooler than my old car. All right, so let's go ahead and go race. Oh, wait, your car needs to have a crew assigned. Ah, oh, let's figure out this crew stuff then. Crew one, European, assign. There, I just took the crew from the other car and put them on this car. Perfect. So we did the figure eight. How about we do the gravel one racetrack? And I think this one might be a little bit longer, so we'll cut it down to three laps. And on the little click, after the little click. So this course, a little bit more complex. What position are we starting in? 10th, that's not bad, right in the middle of the pack. I could probably turn this into a top five, maybe a first place. We'll see. It depends how fast their cars are. I fear that they might be a lot faster than me, though. I don't know. We'll see what happens. First corner. Oh, yeah, that's not how you do it. There's so many cars all trying to go through that corner. It's just chaos. And in the end, I gained one spot somehow. I mean, I did a lot better than only one spot, considering I had a guy right in front of me who was just blocking me after he spun out. That made me lose a lot of speed. Oh, thank you. You had to spin out in front of me, too. Everybody just wants to spin out in front of me, huh? I bet you're going to try to do it, too, huh? I'm not going to let you because I'm going to pass you. Now you, I'm going to make you spin out. Or not. Hey, this is a destruction derby style race. I could just destroy you if I want to and nobody will say anything. I'm going to make you crash into him. Then he'll hate you and he'll destroy you and then you two just fight while I win the race. Whoa, what did he just do? He just, okay, bye-bye. I don't know how he managed to do that, but he just flipped himself over. All right, so I got top five. That's what I said I would get. Anything else is just a bonus. Oh, no, 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 no. Just 
Try to stay on the ground. I was afraid I might flip over there because that, on these corners, it seems like if you try to cut them, they have a little bit of a lip to them, which makes it really easy for you to roll over if you do that. So that's why you don't want to cut the corners. So like right there, nice and safe, just get, keep my spot. I don't want to lose my fifth place. Got one more lap. Let's go for top three on this lap. I feel like I can. All the way. Top three for now. Now, can I get second and first? I don't think I'm going to get first. He has too much of a lead. I might be able to get second by hitting him in a corner, though. Not that corner. He's too far ahead. This is basically my last chance, isn't it? Right here. Because I don't like the, the odds on the other corner. All right, I spun him out, but is somebody else going to come on the inside and pass me? Yes. He will... And that guy has too much distance. I cannot hit him. Hey, top three, though. That's not bad. Still gets me a decent amount of money, probably. Do I get any extra bonuses? I got the speeder. See, I got the fastest lap by, like, a whole second, even. It's just when you start in the middle of the pack, you got some ground to make up. And I'm noticing there's one guy back here who has, like, a really overpowered car compared to everybody else, but he didn't do that good. Everybody else has, like, a car in the 160. 150 range and then there's like a 195 view down there anyways go ahead and continue see how much we made so 720 more than the last race and then we could go ahead and uh, do another race this time we'll do it on the tarmac same setup but a different track and this is like the first track i ever did in this game and if i remember correctly i did really really poorly back then so let's hope i can do better than what i did on my very first attempt at this game ever i mean it's been so long you might as well consider this a first attempt at the game again because i really don't remember any of the uh kind of mechanics of how to really pass people easily and stuff it's just kind of we're winging it right now you know just hit somebody in the corner panel and then hope you don't get hit in the quarter panel like that still gain a few positions overall i think i'm a little bit better on tarmac than the dirt i just feel like i can drive a little bit faster through here but it might be everybody drives faster too and okay I'm trying to finesse my way through it. Last time I was brute forcing it. The guy behind me, he's trying to brute force it on this one. Just going to say, hello, inside line, and weak car, get out of the way. That's the nice thing about having a heavier car. You see, I just shove him out the way. Don't even care that he's there. Then we can almost get top five already, and we still got a lap after this one. Come on, pass, pass, pass. All right, fourth place. I'm going to go for first this race saying it now we're going for first don't know if i'll make it but that's my goal before i had low goals now they're higher out of the way third that was brute forcing it and that slowed me down a lot i could have been going much faster through here if i didn't do that to them but i just see somebody and it's like i gotta hit him gotta hit him gotta hit him like i'm a lot more respectful if i'm playing against real people but against the ai it's full-on destruction derby every corner because they can't complain about it. That was uh, kind of awkward feeling the way I hit that tire. I thought something bad was going to happen, but then basically nothing happened. I, they are just a bit too fast for me. I cannot catch them. Pretty sure I'm gaining. Just can't catch them. Right there, it just went too wide. I could go faster than them then now there's a reason they break they break because they had to that was a good corner keeps me in the lead at least from fourth place and that finish line is like right at the end of the straightaway that could be dangerous that's how I didn't get the fastest lap I actually was beat by the guy behind me by four seconds well two spots behind me that guy was really racing man Showing me how to do it. So another $600. And we might be able to buy some upgrades with that. So here is a American one small block V8. European one. Wait, does that mean we could put like any engine in this thing we wanted to? Oh, no, no, no. Look, only show compatible parts with current car. And well, there's the only engine we can have. Nice and easy there. Uh, those are already equipped, I guess, because they have a check mark. There's something we could actually upgrade. It's 150 bucks. No upgrades there, no upgrades there. I guess I chose a bad car for upgrades because there's not much we can actually do with it. So the check mark means it fits it. Okay. And then the parts I have on it, I got to already know. 
I got you now, game. You know what I'm thinking we might want? We might want a locked differential. Because those times when you go up on two wheels and you can't do much, locked differential might help. What does it have on it right now, though? Let's see. Car info. Not helpful there. Change part. There we go. And then drivetrain right now. It's a limited slip. So can we just buy from there? Find a placement. No, that's getting the exact same part. Change part. All right, so I got to go to the market, buy the part, and then come back. So we're going to get lock differential. Buy. And then, yes, install. Perfect. Let's go race with this thing again. We'll do the next race at... We want somewhere where I could actually hopefully, like, bounce around some. So how about mixed one? Oh, wait. I think I actually recognize this place. I think I've driven here before. And I'm not going to care at all at what position I come in. I am just going to crash into everybody. So that guy right there, we're crashing into him. And we were having the exact same car at the exact same speed, basically. So it was a totally symmetrical crash. And I won't be surprised if I come in dead last the way I'm going to drive this thing. But you know what? Hey, as long as I have fun, I don't care. Like, I see a car over there that I really want to hit. We're going to hit them. We're going to hit them good. That was a nice hit. Hit that guy. Hit that guy. Hit all of them. That's like four hits right there. Just one after the other after the other. That guy's on the wall. What? I feel so bad for that one. He was like so about to slam him and then the car just disappeared. I'm so sorry, red car. That's not fair. And then I hit red car anyways. I may, still f I may feel sorry for them, but I have no sympathy for them. Gotcha. Nah, he got me, didn't he? What's the front of my car look like? Oh, it's so stubby. <laughs> Little stubby car. Red car, but not the red car I saw earlier. So I can hit him without feeling any remorse. I see a guy almost eliminated. Out of the way, I'm taking him out. I actually did a good amount of damage to him just coming in out of nowhere, though. Just keep pushing him up against the wall. Ah, you're flipped over. Kind of wish if you flipped over, though, they would just get eliminated from that instead of just being able to flip themselves over and keep driving. I think flipping them over is a skill. So if you can flip them over, they deserve the loss. I see you again! Might be a different guy, actually. Don't know. Don't care. I see somebody. I'm going to just crash. How's Stubby doing? Oh, it's even stubbier! <laughs> like, I think my front wheel is... As far out as the car goes on the right side, the left side has a little bit of left to it, left to it, and that, that's it. Gotcha! We have matching cars, but mine's stubby or in your face. It's probably a bad thing, but I don't care. It's in your face anyways. I see you with your damage. Have some more. Yep, now it's stubby on both sides. Okay, my wheel is almost in parallel with my driver now. Question is just how far back can we push that wheel by crashing into everybody? I want to crash him. That guy is low damage. Put him into the red. Or the orange, at least. He was kind of in the yellowish. Okay, I lost a tire. This is where things start to go poorly for me. Ha! I lost already. But you know I put off a ton more damage than everybody else. See that? Heavy hitter? Yeah, that's me because I was destroying everybody. Even though I came in basically last. Look at my score. Like, these people got bonuses because they positioned so high. Me, I got a huge score even though I was eliminated already. Question is, how much money does that make? $405, so I made just as much money absolutely failing in that as I did in the races doing good. <laughs> Works for me. So let's see, have we done the mud pit before? Alright, don't think I've done the mud pit, but I might have. I don't recognize it, and I'm trying to hit start with my mouse that doesn't work we gotta actually hit enter on the keyboard so this time same strategy as before i don't care if i'm the first eliminated again well one of the first eliminated i just want to wreck these fools apparently i'm missing everybody though Ooh, if i go around the circle i can get a ton of speed and then really hit somebody the speed that's the speed right there. That's my new strategy. Just circle them, and when somebody goes on the outside, we slam into them. Or if I just see a really appealing hit, like right there. Tires in the way! Gotcha. My brake light still works. 
Nobody's been able to hit me. I'm just hitting them. Tires. Come on, steer. Steer. Hit that guy. T-bone. Oh, you churned on me. I was about to get you good. Then come around again for another attempt. Gotcha. I see the target right there, that car. Got him. And another guy, and another guy, and another guy. I'm hitting everybody. How stubby am I looking? I am very stubby. That's the name for this car from now on. I'm just going to call it Stubby. Flip them! Still got tires. Keep going. I'm not going to have tires for long. This time I really might get dead last. Too aggressive. My rear end is perfect though, and that's where the engine is. Like, I still got the brake light still, which is a feat to me. Hey, I was trying to hit the guy who was almost wrecked. Why you messed me up, man? I was going to kill him. Oh, that guy got me. That guy got me. Hey, that guy's almost dead. I'm going to take him out. I'm going to go one spin around, and hopefully he's still around for me to take him out. Oh, I think somebody just took him out. Yep, somebody else took him out. Take this guy out. Nope, he'll take me out. I thought my engine was like super intact still. No, apparently not. Again, though, lots of damage done. So I got a huge score, even though I was one of the first eliminated. I was actually even worse than last time, believe it or not. I gained a skill level, some repair points, and I got $300 still. Not bad. All right, let's try out the speed bowl. And what are the ones we have? We have deathmatch and team deathmatch. How about we try out deathmatch this time? Don't think I've ever done one here before, so this should be fun. Actually, there's an outside track you could drive on. Interesting. I almost want to do that. So maybe this time I'm going to be real conservative and instead of just wrecking myself, I'll uh, drive around on the race shack while they all crash themselves. Although on this one, you're supposed to take people down. That's the goal. It doesn't matter if you are the first one eliminated. So you know what? That's a bad strategy. Instead, we'll use the track as a method to just ram people at huge speeds. So we like come in like that, hit them, and then go for a lap to get up to speed. Perfect strategy. Nice speed, 100 plus kilometers per hour, and boom. And then we go on the track again. I'm the only one using the track though. Nobody else wants to use the track. They're all just in the pile. I'm the one who's just like jumping out of the pile to smash them harder. That's the, why, that's the reason why I'm the first eliminated. I hit harder than everybody else. So I'm going 120 miles per, or kilometers per hour on the crash. Whoops. That's how you do a two-wheel drift. Let's see. Will somebody flip me upright or will I just get automatically reset? Which will happen first? I think it automatically resets you. If not, you could go into the menu and reset, I know. There's probably a hotkey as well. Well, since nobody wants to hit me, we'll just hit this button because I don't know the hotkey off the top of my head. I could quickly look it up after this video because I should know it probably. Same strategy, getting up to speed, and then we're going to hit somebody. No takedowns yet, but I don't know if anybody has a takedown, to be honest with you. Ironically, I think this is going to be my low score one where the score actually matters. That was two good hits, though. Get my score a little bit higher. We only got eight seconds left, and then it's timeout, though, and we'll see what position I get for all this flying in circles and then jumping into the crash, see if it worked or not. Third place. That's not too bad. People in front of me, how'd they do... They got way more points than me. They're showing me up. How much money I get, though? 450. All right. So let's go ahead and take this car out for one Destruction Derby, and then I think that'll be it for this video. And there are some mods for this game. I don't know what you guys would be interested in seeing if you'd want to see mods or not, so, you know, do leave a comment so I would know. Can we do the Lawnmower Derby Arena with the regular car? Oh, we can. What if everybody else is using a lawnmower? That'd be evil. Now everybody's using a car. I'm kind of sad about that. I was hoping I'd just destroy these fools on lawnmowers with my normal car. 
Gotcha. See, this time I am going to super fast get eliminated because I have a front engine car. And I'm just doing this to everybody, ramming into them like this, just like before. I should have done deathmatch instead of, a, of survival. That probably is a lot better for the way I play. Didn't think about it. Too late now. Flip him! Flip him! Flip him! Ow. He's already flipped. Bump him! Ha! <laughs> I flipped him upright. It's not like it matters. He would have just reset, but still. It's like, oh, I did bad. Pile of cars! Big old pile of cars. Shunt. Right in the bottom, it tells you what you did. Shunt. Shunt. Actually, I don't think that one counted. All right, let's see if this counts for anything. Shunt. Shunt. Bump. I added that one in my own. Okay, this thing's already almost broken. Shunt with a flip. It should do more damage when you flip them over, maybe. Just something. I feel like I deserve something when I flip them over. Some sort of recognition on that. You're going to get squished. I'm surprised that one didn't say shunt. That was a good hit. Got one. Can't see where I'm going. Oh, lots of room to get up to speed right here. Somebody about to get hit hard. That guy who has the low health. Got him. In the side, in the rear. Got that guy too. I think like one more hit and I'm done. Doesn't care. Gonna keep hitting them anyways. Car is upside down. Hit him. I could use the rear of my car if I really wanted to survive longer. I mean, that's the strategic and logical thing to do. But then it's like, look how slow I go. Where's the fun in this? I want to go fast when I hit him. Like that. Oh, that time I got hit. Truthfully, I thought I'd be dead after that crash. Like, I'm just counting the seconds down until I'm actually gone. Again, I thought that was it. Still going. Hey, I did better than before. There's 21 people left. That's better. Still awful, but better. Somebody help me finish this dude. Nobody touch him. I'm finishing him off. Don't you touch him. Don't you touch him. No. I want. I got an assist, I guess. My car is stubby once again. I'm just really good at making a stubby car. Did I get that guy or is he still up? He's still up. I'm going to take myself down, but we're going to finish him. Come on. Get him. Oh, I want to kill him. Stop. Stop! Don't you dare. Oh, somebody else took him down. That makes me so sad. I'm just going to blow my own car up, man. Forget it. Aha, you hit me in the rear. There's somebody low on health. And I missed them. Both times. I saw two people low on health and I missed both of them. Try that again. There's somebody low on health way in the distance. He's not even moving. And now he is. Got him a little bit. Don't think I actually did anything, but I touched him. This guy has way too much health. Forget him. Shunt. Almost eliminated. Nobody touch him. I'm coming back to finish him. This car must be much more durable than the one I was driving earlier or something. Because I am crashing into everybody and everything and it's still going. I lost the wheel, so that's, yeah. We're done. I saw it coming. Huge score. My score is higher than the person who got first place. Shows how good I am at crashing. And that's really just about it. How much money do I get for that? 600 bucks. All right. Gives us 3,000 credits in total. And that'll do it for this video. So until next time, this has been YBR. I'll see you.